Hello guys and welcome to uh, Fluid Mechanics 1 class. Today we're gonna work on the fluid friction uh, apparatus. First of all I'm gonna introduce you the unit and then we're gonna work on the first exercise, the exercise A. The fluid friction apparatus is designed to study the fluid friction head losses which occur uh, when an incomp incompressible fluid flows through the pipes, bends and valves. The fluid friction apparatus is designed to be operated in conjunction with hydraulic bench which helps the flow the water through the system. So the, at the inlet water goes to the test pipes over there. So the unit has uh, four smooth test pipes and one rough test pipe. And in the diagram of the here, the you can see the uh, internal diameters of the test pipe, test pipes. So the first one has this one has uh, five millimeter, second one eight and eleven, seventeen, and the uh, rough test pipe which is at the bottom has 15 uh, millimeters and the length of the uh, between the tappings from here and here uh, uh, one uh, meter for the each test pipe there is a system isolating valve so we're gonna use uh, when we work on the uh, exercise Close and open. So close that. And here we have uh, pitot tubes over here. And here is the venturi. And here we have a globe uh, valve. And this one is a gate valve. So during the experiment, during the first experiment and uh, one of them should be open so we will leave the um, gate valve open and here is the outlet uh, it goes to the volumetric tank over there so let's uh, talk about the hydraulic bench so the hydraulic bench uh, has um, a valve over here which the control valve uh, when we if we want to flow the water through the system we're gonna open the uh, valve and control the water uh, uh, control the uh, flow rate this uh, scale has um, like uh, two levels so the bottom this one is for uh, small flow rates this is for large flow rates and but in the first experiment we won't use this uh, scale we're gonna use the uh, another method so this is a uh, control box uh, turn on the pump and off so in the first uh, exercise we're gonna study the relationship uh, between uh, velocity and head losses of the water when the water flows through the t four test pipes and uh, to measure the uh, head losses uh, between the test pipe we're gonna use a water manometer over here so first of all uh, we have to make sure that our valve is open so then uh, make sure that the tubes from the water manometer over there uh, are connected to the appropriate uh, tappings over here this one and that one so for example we're gonna start with the uh, 17 internal 17 millimeter internal diameter test pipe and and also make sure that the 
uh, required system isolating valve is open over there so I'll leave this open and other uh, valves should be closed so the water so the water from the uh, hydraulic bench flows through the inlet and goes to the our test pipe as I told and the distance between the tappings uh, one meter and the internal diameter of the test pipe so you can find over here is uh, uh, 17 millimeters so the before we start make sure that the uh, water level of the water manometer is the same so to start our experiment uh, to flow the water we have to turn on the our pump over there and and open the control valve over here just for a little bit now we see that the water flows over here to the system and the uh, pressure readings over here so there is a difference between the heads and we're rotating the control valve we can, we can control the flow rate let's make a slow that our uh, water weight is about uh, one kilogram we know that the one kilogram of the uh, water uh, corresponds to uh, one liter in uh, normal uh, conditions and then uh, take the readings from the head loss over here so you see the difference between them it's a uh, 500 and 495 about uh, 5 millimeters and then increase the uh, flow rate just for a little bit by rotating the valve and we see that our flow rate go here and here we see the difference between that again the, the measure the flow rate so Water and click on the timer. 
landmark over here. When you take the bucket, just click the timer here. So it's, uh, it's 11 to around 1.389 liters of water and here take the readings of the head uh, 520 and 495 so take the readings for uh, about eight uh, different flow rates by increasing the control valve over here. When you finish, uh, just slow down the flow rate by rotating the control valve clockwise and turn off our pump and take out the pipes from the tappings from here and close the this valve over there so that's it uh, now our uh, first experiment is finished